Hi, my name is Matt Gray, and I'm from the Central Ohio area. I've been telling my story of decisions and consequences to young people for the last 25 years. You see, I put myself in harm's way. When I was in 9th, 10th, and 11th grade, that's when I started drinking. Now I realize this is 6th, 7th, and 8th grade. And you've got to realize this was many, many years ago when the drinking age was 18. Well, now it's 21. And that doesn't really matter because there are a lot of you folks that can still get alcohol from your older brothers and sisters. If you have cousins, nieces or nephews that are willing to do that for you. And at that point, you're being a risk taker. You're putting yourself in harm's way. And I just wanted to do it because all my cool friends were doing it, or my so-called friends. My, pay, my plans were to meet up with some ladies a little later on. I drank two eight-ounce beers. I smoked a little bit of pot, something I'd done many times before. Now, I'm six foot two, and in that picture, I was about 195 pounds, very healthy, very athletic. And that's one of the reasons the doctor said I survived my accident, because I was healthy and I was athletic. But I was out with my friends, and I left there, and I left the helmet strapped on the side of my motorcycle, because I certainly didn't want to mess up my hair. I was just going to go see up make, see these girls. I wanted to look good when I got there. And I was driving along, just cruising. I thought I was one cool cat out there just cruising on my motorcycle. I was going 25 miles an hour. I missed the corner. I hit the curb on the opposite side. And in this next slide, I went around the corner, I hit the curb, I flipped over the handlebars, boom. Within that instant, I was totally paralyzed. I came down on the top of my head and I broke my neck between the fifth and sixth cervical vertebrae. And that little bump on the back of your neck, feel free to touch it, is your seventh cervical vertebrae. So I broke my neck just above that. And when I did, I was instantly paralyzed. I could not move a muscle. And I'm sure that you've had guys, had your big brother or big sister or somebody get you down and sit on your chest. And that's what it felt like. I couldn't breathe. It was really hard to breathe. I couldn't move my arms. I couldn't do anything but pray. Matt Gray was really inspiring to me because um, he just shows us like our decisions always have consequences and it really like personally hits home to me because we've had a situation like that in my family and I just think that everyone should hear about this because sometimes people are like that will never happen to me but it, ha it can happen to anyone so it was really inspiring. Hi I'm Fairfield County Sheriff Dave Phelan. And just let me say that Mac Gray is a terrific speaker. He is inspiring to young people as he gives a message about decisions and consequences. And I've known Mac for about 20 years and I can tell you he's a wonderful guy. And I think he would certainly be inspired by his presentation. I would enjoy speaking to your group. Please contact us using the information on this demo.